After a month of bye weeks and road games, the Huskies returned to Rensselaer Field and gave fans a great game. They battled inclement weather, but walk away with a 37 to 29 victory, giving UCF its first ever conference loss. We're right outside the locker room right now, and these guys are so excited. So much energy buzzing around this squad after last week's performance, and now today, there is a lot to look forward to as the season continues. In the locker room, you know, everybody's singing, dancing, and, and it's, it's just a great time, like, having fun with, with your football family and everybody, and really, these are my brothers, so it's just a great time. There's nothing better than winning, so, I mean, you've got to be amped up, you got to be excited, and I think we're all optimistic right now. We, we just knew we had to finish. We learned from our mistakes again uh, and last week. We didn't finish the right way. They, they made more plays than we did, so we wanted to come out and finish it this week. We finally played four quarters of football. Uh, coach has been stressing that. Uh, Actually, for the whole season now, because uh, you know we played one half, few quarters, three quarters, and uh, we came out and played four quarters, so that, that was really big for the team. We went in with the understanding that's how they produce points, big plays, and we made calls appropriately to try to eliminate those opportunities. Um, on offense, we protected the ball well, and and that was the difference in the game. I mean, turnover and turnover margin is such a big factor. It's really electrifying uh, because when the offense is going, really the whole team's going. Uh, they bring a lot of energy. To the, to the team, and uh, I, I'm just proud to see them succeed. It's not really that big of a surprise because you know we we watch them you know every week in practice, and they continually get better, and uh, they're doing a heck of a job. Just great to give back to them and to the fans who come to every game, and we haven't won a lot of them recently, but they come every game and they support us, and it feels good to give back to them. That's the best. It's absolutely the best. Uh, the UConn country and the Husky fans in this state have just been awesome. We feel the love. The players talk about it. The coaches talk about. It. It's so great to come back home after a month and play at home and see all the people that were there and the, and the inclement weather and, and wind and rain and cold. And we're just so proud to represent this state. We're a good team. We just need to, we, once we put these pieces together and we start rolling and the, you know, the snowball starts getting bigger and bigger, we're, we're going to be tough to beat. And uh, I think that showed against ECU and, and we're even better this week against UCF. And moving forward, we're going to see a UConn team that you know, has a lot of juice, a lot of energy, and, and we, we, we're, we're going to try and win every game and, and that's the only thing you should be thinking about so we're ready to go. The Huskies look to keep this momentum rolling as they head down to Yankee Stadium next Saturday to face Army at 3:30. We hope to see all of you fans there reporting at Rensselaer Field for Huskies All Access. I'm Erica Walker.